Hello everyone, this is Chris with AOUsers.com and the US Tech Channel. Today I'm going to be cutting this micro sim down to a nano sim. Now, uh, a couple years ago I did some traveling and a lot of the places I went to they only had these uh, mini sims. And devices were just starting to uh, use the micro sim. And nowadays, uh, some of the ones I've actually gone down to the nano sim so if you go somewhere and they don't have an actual tool to cut these and they don't have the card available you can actually use uh, something like this template which I'll link to in the description below and uh, make the appropriate card now it notes on the side that the actual chip is on this inner portion so that's why you can cut the mini sim down and uh, keep on cutting it down it's just using a marker and a uh, straight edge to make the lines. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have much time right now. Um, and this is all I have on me. You can see that the, the micro sim or the nano sim fits right in there. This is the actual one that we're going to cut right here. And you can see by these lines how much we need to cut off. Let me go ahead and align it. So just print this out at 100% and you should be good to go. If your browser is at 100% and you go to this website, um, it should uh, give you an accurate representation of how much uh, you need to cut off just by holding it up to your actual monitor. So basically we're going to cut off this whole back part most of the front on the bottom pretty much going to butt right up against the contacts here and really the top you're supposed to cut just a little bit off pretty much getting it right up against the contacts I have a really bad pair of scissors here so I don't know if this will work. Let's start with the easy parts. It does suggest that you also have a way to grind down the edge for this corner. Alright, let's see. This one still looks a little bigger. Probably gonna have to grind down a little more. Let's see if it fits in the tray. It's mainly just the corners that need a little shaving because they're supposed to be rounded slightly. So better to make smaller cuts than larger ones. Now it looks like it fits in there. 
Let's go ahead and place it in a device. Looks like it's getting signal now. Let's take it off of Wi-Fi. And there you go, we have LTE. So I've successfully cut a micro SIM down to a nano SIM. For more information on things like this, please like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's viewers like you that allow me to make these videos. Thanks a lot.